What do you got for us today? Picture time. We got a couple right. today, Josh. All right, we're going to start off with the first one that comes to us from Jay Barrow, resident of Southwest Tucson. My cat, Sis. She's polydactyl. Notice she's got an extra toe in the front paw. Wow. Yeah, that's not... I didn't even notice that the yeah, first time. Yeah, that's not too uncommon. My mom has a couple of cats that are like that, and Ernest Hemingway's cats were like that <laughs> I thought you were say your mom had an extra toe. <laughs> oh, no, I wasn't no, going to no. laugh. <laughs> I, was, I promise I wasn't going to laugh. Well, I wasn't going to say that. Don't worry. So he says, sis, don't wake me up or I'll scratch. He don't want the that extra toe. Change them up a little bit this okay, hour. Let's check first one I want to show you is from uh, Jay Barrow of Southwestern Tucson. He says, sis, this is sis, this cat, don't wake up or I'll scratch. Notice something a little bit freaky about that cat. I didn't last time, it, but I do now. It's a polydactyl. It means it's got an extra toe there. Pterodactyl? Yeah. No, polydactyl. Polydactyl. Pterodactyl is a dinosaur. <laughs> and that's not that uncommon. In fact, uh, Ernest Hemingway had some yeah, cats that were like that as well.